let's talk about Halloween, folks. It may be good fun for the kids to dress up as a cowboy or astronaut or ballerina and trick-or-treat, but this trend of grown adults glorifying the likes of Spider-Man by dressing up as them is, especially in the times we live in, disturbing. What say you, Gino from the Bronx? Yeah, well, I get your point, but my girlfriend got this sexy Spider-Girl costume, and it really spices things up. Know what I'm saying? Huh. I most certainly do not. J. Jonah Jameson is not one to be judgmental, but you, sir, are an extremely disturbed man! Goodbye! There's the Akamax plant. Oh, good timing. Tombstone's men are loading fresh supplies. What for, though? Is he getting back into drugs? They're heavily armed. This might be easier if I stay quiet. Where are all the security guards? This is a ghost town. Boss paid for them. Oh, does show up. Shoot him. We make it. Hey, you guys aren't registered pharmacists. The no lab coats thing gave you away. Tombstone's men are down. Now to find out what's in these barrels. Diox 3. Isn't this the chemical Tombstone was exposed to as a kid? What's he doing with it now? That stuff's not for asthma. More dudes, more drugs. Someone's got to teach these guys about the dangers of here for sure. feeling those drug inhalers and the Diox-3 are related. Should analyze an inhaler to find out what's going on here. All right, what's in you?
Diox 3 plus designer amphetamines. Pretty clever recipe for temporary invulnerability. I'm impressed. And worried. This stuff hits the street and there'll be a huge market for it. With Tombstone as the sole supplier. Think I can synthesize a counter drug. Wonder if there are any lab supplies in that truck. Time for some artisanal science. There. Single dose of the counter drug. Just need to test it out.